It's 7 in the morning and the sun is still not up. This is how winter is. So we're heading to somewhere and see the lakes are so frozen. And we're on our road trip. And we're having a nice view here. There are so many ice everywhere and snowy roads but this one it's kind of clear and the river is oh i mean the lake and see how beautiful the mountain is filled with the snow and we're approaching and this is a clear river and it's not frozen and we're getting near to our destination so this is the way going to the right is going to prince rupert and to the left is going to alaska this is the bridge and we are so near and there we go we arrive Prince Rupert this is the welcome note or a I mean is the welcome placard and there you have it welcome to the city of Prince Rupert yeah hey finally we've arrived and I have uh, admired the beautiful and colorful shops and uh, their view of the sea and they have a lot of cafes and restaurants and museums that is a view of the ocean a bay view and there you have it and you can go inside and take a look of how beautiful the uh, place and to see the yachts and different kinds of boats and to have a walk and there you have it let's go in the city is known for its aesthetic attraction that is perfect for your pictorials and instagrammable posts and they also cater some boat trips and rides but they will do it during summer and since win winter is not a perfect time for it and the city is near by an ocean so they are famous of different kinds of seafood that you can try and buy and the top one is the salmon we also had a chance to take a look at the crabs but it's so expensive that it costs 27 dollars well we are taking some pictures luckily we found something guess what a sea lion there you have it and he's flowing freely and let's wait what else he can do for us and we're busy taking some videos he's quite near us and suddenly he had an exhibition a flip line yeah there you go a beautiful shot and we're happy that we've encountered and witnessed how the sea lion swims over You can bring your families and friends here and it's open for the public that you can have a tour and it's sightseeing. Oh, a duckling showed up!
here also showed up in front of us in crossing the street. Oh, there are two! Yes. We stopped by the church and said our prayers. The main purpose is to visit the Philippine store and to shop. On our way, we found these longest train. Catch a beautiful sunset. Another day is Thursday, January 27, and we're going out for a dinner. An audio. This is the, the Thornhill Pub. Prawns with vegetables and rice and bread plus the fish and chips.